Hey, today we're going to be talking about Pro Writing Aid, but we're going to be looking at the free version of it. So there is a subscription model. There's actually two subscription tiers for Pro Writing Aid. I'm big on accessibility here on my channel, so I want you to be able to do things without having to spend money as much as possible. I love the subscriptions that I have. I'm not canceling any of them anytime soon but I don't want you to feel like you have to spend money to be able to first of all enjoy AI and then also get your books done and get some nice edits out of them. So what I'm going to show you today is Poe without a subscription. We're just going to use GPT-4 and then well we're using GPT-4.0 and then also Pro Writing Aid, the free version, using just a Google Doc. You can do it in Poe too. It's just this little plugin right here for Chrome, but I don't suggest keeping anything within Poe. I don't want you to ever lose anything. So always have your stuff backed up. Even you know with Novel Crafter, I constantly export my stuff at least once a day so that I have backups. I have lost books in the past. I'm never wanting to go through that again. I don't want to have my heart broken like that. So I'm just going to go to GPT-40. I'm just going to ask it for the first chapter of a contemporary romance. I'm not going to give it anything else but that. I'm going to tell it that it's got to be in past tense. And then I'm just going to copy that, put it into the Google Doc, and see what Pro Writing Aid gives us. So with Pro Writing Aid, with the free version, we are going to not have all of the, like, the little tools, which is understandable. They want something for the people who actually pay. But I wanted to try it out. I'm going to do a month subscription in just a little bit. And then if I like it, I'll probably jump on the lifetime because if you factor it in, the lifetime is about the same price as paying for it for three and a half years. So it's a big commitment. It's a big chunk of money. It's more than a car payment. It's probably more than some mortgages, depending on how much your house or your condo is. But if you're going to be writing long term, I don't see myself stopping anytime soon. Probably death would stop me, but that's about it. You know, I enjoy writing. I've been doing it for decades. I'm going to continue. So for me, you know, having that lifetime subscription is a good buy, but it is worth noting how expensive it is. We have this. This is cute. I'm going to leave that because I'm not continuing this story. I'm just using it for a little demonstration. Don't do that. All right, so here is what GPT-40 gave us. Here's what Pro Writing Aid has to say about it. So we've got some improvements. We've got some goals. I have it set to romance. You can change it to whatever you like. That's kind of a really nice thing because romance has different rules and different goals than say an academic journal. So we have it on romance. We could use more sentence variety. We have some blue words. We've got a little bit of passive voice. We can definitely address that. We've got some dialogue tags that could be removed. We've got lots of unusual dialogue tags. Okay. 
We could definitely show them more emotion. We've got some weak adverbs. So these are all great suggestions. Now we're going to go here. You only get so many rephrases per day on the free one. So if you're waiting until you are done with the book to edit it and you're on the free one, you're going to run out of rephrases really quickly. Also, the rephrases don't always make sense. So really think about it before just accepting it. Very sure that this is supposed to be window. There's already a space there. That made absolutely no sense. That's a premium suggestion. We don't have access to that. That created an issue. Modern something. Aesthetic, maybe, is missing. Neither of those I really like. I'm going to ignore that. Where is this one that you have in it? Sure, a sketch pad is fine. Where is this that you have a problem with? It's not supposed to be a period there. Ignore. Okay, yes. We can get rid of that. So is it perfect? No. Did it make some nice improvements? Probably. Take a look at this. We need more sentence variety still. We've still got a bunch of blue words. And it's nice that it explains why it's staying that. Instead of just being like, this is the rule. Like, why do I want to get rid of dialogue tags? See, while I agree with that, I think whispered, mumbled, and moaned are also completely usable. Because there's going to be times when it's not just said, said, said. We can stay in a soft 
tone we can you know. Oh, I mean, we also need to use yellow for some points. So I wouldn't say get rid of most of them, but maybe take that little criticism and see what you do with it. So what do you think of Pro Writing Aid? I think it has some good ideas. I think this is helpful. I think some of the passive changed it to something that was nonsense. So it's definitely not something where you can take every single little thing that it says and go with it. But is it usable? Sure. The free version is nice. We can learn some things, we can improve our writing. This I find to be the most helpful thing. But at the same time, don't take everything that it says and like don't look at this and go, okay, everything has to be said or asked. You know? Use your own best judgment too. These are suggestions. All editing is going to be suggestions. It's just a matter of, hey, does this actually help? Or, you know what, is this something that I'm gonna use my own judgment? I'm gonna know my own writing. Use this to get better. Don't make it your guide. Don't make it your absolute rule. But thank you so much for watching. I'd love to know your thoughts on providing it, especially those that have it already. Do you find that the lifetime subscription is worth it? I'm probably going to be jumping on it pretty soon because I've found it to be helpful in improving my own work. But you know, it's definitely something where you have to think about it and not just go accept, accept, accept. Because like you saw, Sometimes things just don't make any sense, but it does help and it does give you an idea of what you can improve on. So thank you so much for watching. See y'all later.